I'm Hester and the, I'm a doctoral researcher in the IPRS. I study the ontogeny of migration. So what species do you study? I study the white stork. White storks are large, they uh, weigh about three to four kilograms and they have two meter wingspans which means that they can't afford to use flapping flights, so they use soaring flights to accomplish long distance migrations that are usually between 500 and 10,000 kilometers. So how do you study these migrations? We use GPS tracking devices that allow us to see their locations and we use triaxial accelerometers that give us positional data. And do you have some exciting findings so far? Um, so far, we've found a couple of interesting things. So one thing is that we've tracked their fine scale soaring flight at the one hertz level and looked at how they fly inside of thermal uplifts. And we found that adults actually perform more poorly than juveniles do. So juveniles soar better than adults. And that's because adults are migrating at times that are less supportive for them. So thermal uplift conditions are worse. Um, and what we take from that is that adults are actually choosing to do more energetically costly migrations because that is what is optimal for them. Um, and another thing we found was looking at the one hourly level, they're selecting their routes on the basis of where they will find strong uplifts, but also on the basis of where they'll find other white storks. Um, but that also changes as they age. So the younger birds are more likely to tune their routes to where they'll find other storks than the adults are. What do you think is cool or unique about your study system? The great thing about white storks is the volume of research that has been done on them. White storks have been being studied in this area for the last two centuries and we really do know a lot about their behavior and about where they go and um, who nests with whom and how these populations split and join um, so that we have a really good basis then we can delve deeper into more specific questions instead of first looking at what exactly are these animals and where are they. <laughs>